Hello, welcome to the tutorial series on introduction to rising laser components. So my name is Benjamin Fadina. In this tutorial, we shall use a simple order entry system as case study. So in this first lesson, I'm going to add a rising blazer component to a new server side project created with Visual Studio. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start Visual Studio. So I will click on create new project. Then uh I'll click on next. Okay. Sorry, let me go to that. So you have all languages, all platforms. So I will click there. So I'm searching for C sharp, let me click on C sharp. So our project types I'll think I'm going to pick Blazor. So Blazor server app. I'll click on next. So other Entry. Server. Server side. That's the name of that project. So I want to save it on my C drive huh? in a folder called other entry server side. Then I'll click on next. The project I want to be, I want to use .NET 7. And for the authentication type, I want to use individual accounts. Then I'll click on create. Now that I've created the app, the next thing I want to do is to run the app. So I'll just click the button here. And these are my app looks like now. I'm going to stop the app. So I'm going to navigate to blazor.ratsing.com. I'll click on get started. So after clicking on get started, step one says I should install the radsync.blazor package. So I'll go back to my project. I'll right click on other entry server side. So I practicing dot laser. I'm going to browse. Practicing dot laser. 
this it and I'll click install I'll click OK I'll click I accept I'll click save all I'll click save all and at this point I'll go to build build solution Now, the next thing is for me to import the namespace. So I'm going to open imports.json and I'm going to add these two lines at using Razin, at using Razin.json. So I'll go to imports. Let me just copy them over. Which copy as you say, Ratsin. It's using Ratsin the blazer. That is done. Then says open pages slash layouts .chtml or pages that's it that's for blazor server dot nexus or pages slash host cshtml blazor server dot next seven let me go to solution is totally open so I have host for chtml So I'm going to copy this line. Just below the entry server stars. to add that now the next thing is that I'm going to include this script rising dot blazer dot js so I'm going to Copy this razing.blazor.js script link. I'll go back to the project. I'm going to paste it before the blazor.server.js uh, stuff. Then I'll click. After doing that, I'll click save all. Now, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to go to index or trace or under pages. I'm going to clean everything that is on the back of. I'm going to put this. Now I want to use the, the code behind structure. So I'm going to right click on pages. I'll say add new class. So I'm going to add index.razor.cs. This is going to be the code behind a uh, file for my index.resort page. Now I'm going to add the partial keyword to make this a partial class. Now 
now we have this event called for the button click. So let me make it a private event. I did the private keyword. I'm still coming back to implement this button click event. Everything is fine now. So what do I do? It says open shared main layout dot razor file and include browsing dialog, browsing notification, browsing context menu, browsing to tool tip. I'm going to copy all this. Then I'm going to go to shared. I'll go to main layout. I'll paste all this. So I'll now come behind. I'm going to I'm now going to come to index.razor.cs. I'm now going to say inject. And I'm going to say at using Microsoft. I'm going to say inject. Then I'm going to to import the new space using microsoft.tsp.net components. Now, I'm going to get protected. Notification service, notification service, get set. Now, I'm going to display a message saying, Welcome. Ransom Laser Components. How will I do that? Say notification service. Sorry. Notification service. Dot. Notify then notification severity dot okay. Let me see Sussex welcome, welcome as the header for the notation. Say welcome to. Rancing laser components. 
Now I want to de display this message for 10 seconds. So I'll put the time in milliseconds, which is 10,000. Now I'm going to open start of the CS. I'm going to add all this. Build out the services that that's cool. So I'll go to start of the CS. But now what we have is sorry, program the CS. I'm opening program the CS. So after I build out the services that add simple term, I got forecast service. So build out the services, add school notification service, add all this. And say at the top, parking name space has been imported. So it's time to run our app. But before we run our app, let's look at. Okay, this is the markup once again. So let's run our app. So I click run. And I click. Hi, it says, Welcome to Rising Blizzard Components. So this is the end of the first lesson. Thank you for watching.